Finally, what is the crack, lads? We have got friendly match lobbies, and we are going to be introducing a brand new series that I'm going to be doing on this channel. I'm actually buzzing for it because we are going to have a bit of crack with it. I want this series and I want this kind of friendly match lobbies to be a break from eFootball and the sweat and the meta stuff and the tryhard mode. I want this to be a bit of crack for content. We are going to be picking a Manchester United past and present. We are playing Shales who's using an Arsenal past and present there. So any player that has ever played for Arsenal, he's using any player that has ever played for Manchester United, I am using. So I've got Scolzi with Anthony, with Ibra, with Cristiano Ronaldo, with Chicorito, with De Gea. So yeah, it's it's a bit of crack. And I am going to be doing a new series. And just to introduce that, I am going to be opening this up for any of you guys that want to play me that are subscribed to this YouTube channel, the Pez Universe YouTube channel. So if you are interested in playing me and you want to show your skills and you want to you want to beat the shit out of me, basically, <laughs> and uh, have it up on YouTube. Uh, let's have a bit of crack with it. There will be one or two rules, obviously, because as I said, I don't want this being, you know, like try hard kind of sweat mode. I want this to have a bit of crack with it and to be able to kind of rip each other and have a bit of banter with it um, and just have a bit of a change. And speaking of banter, what about that for a goal <laughs> to open it up against Shales Saliba with an absolute horror at the back? Disaster. But uh, yeah, I mean, there's there's still a crazy couple of things happening, but I think it just strips away a lot of the try-hard stuff where, you know, you have to win every single game. Because I think a lot of people that like to play online like to win more matches than lose more, you know, more often than not. So um, obviously that does start to creep in a little bit and then frustration starts to creep in. Whereas in this, you can kind of play, you have a little bit more time on the ball. You're not getting, you know, we weren't sweating each other. We weren't pressuring each other. Oh, look at that. Absolute rinse him. Sorry, Shales. But I am playing Shales. Most of you guys might know him. He's one of the OGs of the Pez scene. One of the best collections of Pez memorabilia and merch ever. If you guys want to follow him on uh, Twitter, he decided to jump in and test his medal. We played two matches home and away. So what I'm going to probably do to open up this series, lads, right? is we are going to be playing against any of you guys that are watching this video are more than welcome to join and i'm either going i'm going to be doing a mixture i'm going to be doing live videos where i'm going to be doing a live stream and i'm literally just going to put up my lobby uh my match room with the password and whoever gets into the lobby whoever joins is going to be able to just come in and play me and it'll be what whoever gets into the lobby um whether that will be if you guys want to play me or not a lot have been asking me and then i'm going to be doing designated uh videos as well where i kind of not kind of analyze the gameplay but more kind of like a competitive edge using the lower ranked teams and that would have been an unreal goal so obviously like with this squad i'm not using all my legends i'm not using riviera makalele ronaldinho messi and Haaland up front i'm using kind of different players that aren't really trained up so i will be doing a couple of rules so we'll have a couple of rules such as team strength we'll have a couple of rules maybe we can do a squad that you guys pick for me and then we'll do maybe 10 matches against uh, subscribers and we'll have a bit of a tournament over it um we also are working with the lads over on the twitter at pez uni as well as pez universe spain we are working on a big tournament that we are going to be doing um so hopefully uh i I will be able to get a couple of guys that watch these videos a couple of subscribers watch this for a chance lads this would have been one of my best goals ever look at this for a shot absolute crisp but it doesn't go in and sorry about no sound as well lads i actually was talking to shales on party chat and the sound obviously uh blocked off because i didn't have my splitter set up so if we are doing future videos i'll probably be like live comment so um you obviously will get the sound as normal, but yeah, uh, that's just a little thing there. Man, Anthony, oh, he's so good, man. He's just, I love playing with him. He kind of like reminds me of like a classic old school dribbler that you bought in Master League that was just chef's kiss like was just different class but we did have a really good match i felt like i was kind of comfy enough but shale started to get into the game a little bit more from the 70th minute on and you'll see why in a second but yeah it was a really good game he got a great chance here terrible defending by me brilliant save by de gea I am kind of weak in a couple of areas. Like we have De Maria and Ronaldo. We've got a couple of the past players as well, like um, uh, Ibrahimovic. We have De Maria, as I said. There's another good chance there. The collision system, lads, still needs work. It does still need work. I think the dribbling and the defensive AI pressure system has been changed a little bit and it's been adapted and it's better that you can kind of have that extra second on the ball and decide what to do. The passing lanes, I think, are maybe like a little bit better as well. 
But I still think that they need to do big work on the collisions. They need to do still big work on the referee algorithm as to when he blows, when he doesn't blow. You'll see here, lads, the 83rd minute, a crushing tackle goes in, a crunching tackle goes in, and Pique back at the club. He does get his uh, he does get his his marching orders as uh, as we face into the 90th minute or so. But I felt like I could hold on. But Shales had other plans. Watch this for a move inside here. I get the ball. I try to spam a clear. Try to clear it. Take too much. Uh, on it it was too cocky and then Harry Maguire absolutely butcher bays and there's a bit of a fight go on Maguire give it into him headbutt headbutt but Maguire is up for the battle lads and this is what we're going to be bringing to these friendly match lobbies a load of fighting and a load of uh, rowing but that is a cracking free kick from Shales the fucker that is a cracking free kick from him in fairness and uh, 90 minutes on the clock a man down it is looking like this one is going to be a share of the spoils so yeah so lads that is kind of that is kind of going to be it. We have the second match of this. And what I'll be doing is opening it up the, the, the lobby match, dropping the lobby up. I'll put up a comment on YouTube or I'll put a tweet up on Twitter. So if you're not following over on Twitter, make sure you're following there and make sure you are subscribed to the channel as well. And then we'll be putting up the match lobby. We'll put up the password. Whoever enters it and whoever actually gets to connect into the lobby whenever I decide to go live or whenever I decide to record a video that will be who I'll play, and then we'll keep track of the scores and stuff ourselves. I mean, look, lads, it's it goes without saying, right? It's like a broken record. Like, all of this stuff should have been here from day one. There's nobody, I think, that is still playing this game that is an apologist is saying that it's, like, it's good enough that a year on we're only getting a friendly match lobby. But at the end of the day, right, like... You can still be excited about being able to play your friend without having to share play. Like, do you know what I mean? And you can do a lot of stuff now that you weren't able to do. Is it good enough? No. But at the same time, does that mean that we can't enjoy it because, you know, it didn't come out like at launch? I mean, I want Master League. You guys know me that I'm a massive Master League fan. I want Master League more than anybody. Like, not saying my opinion is more than anybody, but I'm saying that I want it as much as ye diehard guys that want Master League. But at the same time, I play a game and to have fun, man. I play a game and to kind of have a bit of an escape as a as a, an entertaining kind of like thing. Um, the same way as I'd watch a movie or the same way as I watch TV or go to the cinema or whatever I decide to do. If it's not fun for me, I won't play it. As you've seen with, you know, previous patches where I just haven't enjoyed playing the gameplay that I haven't been as uploading as regularly, right? The game can frustrate me, but if I'm still enjoying certain parts of it, I still will play it. But if I'm not enjoying it, I find it hard to put out videos and content. You know what I mean? So if I am enjoying it, that's all I want out of it. You know, it's the same as any other game that I play. Every game online is going to have huge issues. The direction that they've taken is a completely different conversation than, you know, that we're having about actually enjoying a friendly match lobby. So I love hearing all your opinions. I love hearing your guys' thoughts on where you're at with it. And I, I must say, lads, you guys that are subscribed to me, like, you're seriously you know, in tune and intelligent and some of the topics and the points that you guys bring up in the comments are brilliant. Like I'd be reading them all. I mightn't get back to them all, but I do read them all. It's a sharp little finish there. And Shades is going to give me another game here before this day is over. But yeah, I, I genuinely, lads, I, uh, it's a massive, massive, massive thank you for all the support you guys have because I have been trying to grind and get out a lot of videos because I'm interested in doing it. You know what I mean? I'm interested in doing player reviews. I'm interested in doing that type of content. Um, You know, so... Yeah, I do appreciate all the support, but we are just going to end this match up by pummeling shields. He gets, I get lucky here, and it is that man again, Antonio Anthony, with a little sharp touch and go. And we're going to get a fourth goal as well right at the end. So yeah, lads, let me know what you guys think about this idea. And do you think that that's a, the best way of doing it? Just putting up the match lobby and whoever joins, joins. And then we might be able to do it as well. Um, What I was thinking of doing was like doing kind of like a like a dedicated subscriber uh, where we do it out of a raffle, where we put all the names into a hat and then we raffle it out. But yeah, if we do it at a random time, it's whoever kind of is around at the time instead of trying to organize it too deeply. But I will keep you guys updated on the league that I am doing and the Pez Universe League. So don't forget to subscribe, lads, if you do, and follow on Pez Universe Twitter. If you want to get involved with the Friendly Match Lobbies, that's it for me. Peace!